Here's a cool trick if you use Netflix. So I don't know about you guys, but it's kind of annoying to me when other people watch my shows. And to prevent that, you can actually add a passcode to your profile. To set it up, just go to account, then find your profile and turn profile lock on. And now you have a pin for your profile. Make sure to share this with all of your friends and follow for the best life hacks. Here's how to not throw up. People with motion sickness know the struggle, but vomiting is actually necessary sometimes. For example, if you have food poisoning. However, if you feel nauseous due to stress or motion sickness, this is definitely gonna help you out. All you gotta do is start humming and that's gonna stop your gag reflex. Might seem a bit weird, but hey, better than throwing up on a plane, right? Okay, everyone, you have to watch this if you have an iPhone. Okay, if you go to settings, privacy, location services, system services, and significant locations, don't freak out, but there's gonna be a history of all your frequently visited locations. To turn it off, just turn off significant locations. This is just a PSA if you want to, but everyone go to your settings right now and see what locations they have for you. And make sure to send this to all of your friends that have iPhones. Hidden iPhone hacks you need to know about part two. Okay, if you hold the send button in iMessage, you can send messages with different really cool effects. Triple click the power button to turn on a magnifying glass that you can use on anything. You can shift your keyboard to one side for one-handed typing. If you want to hide a picture from your friends, you can put it in a hidden folder. This is how anyone can lucid dream. Okay, so for those of you that don't know what lucid dreaming is, it's when a person is dreaming and actually knows they're dreaming. It usually happens during the REM sleep cycle. And because of this, you can actually control whatever happens in your dream. So if you really want to fly, you can do that when you lucid dream. One really cool technique is the wake back to bed technique. And all you have to do is wake up five hours after your bedtime. Then when you go back to sleep, you're going to be more likely to lucid dream. Now there's a couple different ways to know if you're actually lucid dreaming. So if you guys like this video, I'll make a part two about those. Here are the best student discounts part two. All right, first off, students can get 20% off at Timberland. You can get 15% off at J. Crew, And you can also get 15% off at Kate Spade. My personal favorite is Nike, which gives 20% off. Make sure to share this with all of your friends and follow for the best life hacks. Here's how to get out of zip ties. Okay, so I got my zip ties from the garage. First step is to tighten it as much as you can. Once it's as tight as you can get it, lift your arms up above your head um, and then just swing down as hard as you can. Not too bad. I'm running out of time right now, so I'll make a part two tomorrow where I talk about what to do if your hands are behind your back. And I know a lot of you guys know this trick already, but even if you do, please try sharing it with as many people as possible because this can save a life. I have friends that have had really close calls where they almost had to use something like this. So once again, let's try to get the word out to as many people as possible. Here's how to always win at rock, paper, scissors. And by the way, keep watching till the end because I'm going to try to break a world record. But first, here's how to always win. Okay, so what you need to know is that in a game of three, winners tend to stay with what they picked and losers tend to switch. So for example, if you lose, you'd go from rock to paper. Here's an example. Round one, you're rock and your opponent is paper, you lose. So because your opponent won in round one, they're going to stick with paper and you can go scissors to beat them. And in round three, they're going to switch from paper to scissors and you can beat them with rock. Okay, here's the fun part. The largest rock, paper, scissors tournament had 3,000 people. I want to make my own tournament and beat that record. And it would be sick to get some verified and famous people to join too. So tag everyone you can. If this video blows up, I'll set up a tournament bracket and a website with rankings. I'll also do a cash prize and who knows, you might win. Here's a super cool life hack for you guys. Okay, go to Google and download this Chrome extension. And once you download it, you're gonna be able to watch any video in the corner of any screen. Sometimes I just watch Netflix while doing homework. And I also use it for watching YouTube videos while I'm taking notes. Share this with all of your friends and follow for the best life hacks. Everyone watch this if you use TikTok. Okay, everyone try this right now. Go to your discovered page and type in rewards. A page is gonna pop up where you can earn points for doing different things on TikTok. And you can redeem the points for prizes. Also, once you set it up, you're going to get a blue diamond on the top left of your profile. Share this with your friends so you can get points together. 
These life hacks will change your life. Okay, first, when making passwords, use letters with accents on them and people won't be able to figure it out. To check if a battery is good, just drop it from six inches up. If it bounces once, then falls over, it's good. If it bounces more than that, it's dead or almost dead. If you're always mixing up the left and right side of your earphones, make a small knot on one of them like this. Put a card in your wallet with this information. It could save your life. Apple just released iOS 14 and here's what it looks like. One of my favorites, when you get a call, it won't take up the whole screen so you can ignore it and do other stuff. There's new home screen widgets that can be pinned, stacked, and resized. And a cool app library. Another favorite picture-in-picture -picture video so you can watch videos while doing other things. And Siri won't take up the whole screen anymore. I'm downloading the beta version right now so stay tuned. Here's some iPhone hacks I guarantee you didn't know about part 4. You can create custom vibrations for different contacts. Just click ringtone and vibration. Then click create new vibration and tap out whatever pattern you want. Dial this number and click on serving cell measurements to see how strong your signal is in different places. Long press flashlight to change its brightness. Lock your camera focus point by holding the screen until AF lock pops up. Here's some iPhone hacks I guarantee you didn't know about part two. To rearrange apps faster, long press one and then click others to group them together. Swipe in with three fingers to copy and swipe out to paste. Drag with two fingers to select multiple messages. Go to timer and select stop playing. I use this so that my music turns off as I'm falling asleep.